Hi everyone, I'm Nadia and in today's video, my mom is making a beautiful set of heart-shaped beach resin coasters, which is perfect for Valentine's Day coming up. She starts off by mixing in her Part A and Part B resin. And in this video, she's using resin by Let's Resin and I'll have it linked in my description along with a discount code if you'd like to give it a try. It's a one-to-one -one ratio by volume, and once equal parts are poured into her larger cup, she starts to mix them together. Once it's mixed together well, she pours it into a smaller cup and adds in some very small glass pieces. And she also adds in some gold tinted glass, along with some craft sand. Then she adds in this very light pink shade of mica powder from Resin Pro and she mixes it all together. As always, I'll have all of the products that you see in this video listed in my description. She starts off by applying a very small amount of resin into the bottom of her molds before she adds in her sand. And this is a good way just to make sure that you're not gonna be creating any air bubbles that will get trapped on the bottom of your molds. And with a small spoon, she applies the sand into the molds. She pours clear resin into smaller cups to add in her pigments. The first pigment she's using is this mica powder in the shade Watermelon Red from Let's Resin. In her next cup, she uses the same light pink mica powder that she previously used with her sand. And she also adds some into her Watermelon Red pigmented resin. And then also add some of the watermelon red mica powder into her light pink pigmented resin. And she starts off by pouring her red pigmented resin at the top of her molds. Followed by her pink pigmented resin right below. and she's mixing in more of the light pink mica powder to pour a lighter shade near the bottom. And then continues to pour in her other shades as well. And here she is the next day demolding. She also added a few shells into the sand area, which wasn't filmed. Now she's preparing them to do a layer of resin out of the mold and to do this, she flips them over onto the back side and uses liquid latex. Liquid latex will protect the bottom side from any resin leaking over so that it doesn't harden onto the resin on the back if it flows over, but will harden onto the liquid latex, which will then easily be able to get peeled off the next day. And we do put our liquid latex in ketchup bottles for easy application. Once the liquid latex is poured around the edges of the coasters, she uses a silicone stick to help push the liquid latex to the very edge. And once the liquid latex has dried, she props them up onto cups. She mixed in her resin once more and starts to pour it into smaller cups to add in her pigments. She starts off by adding Deepon's Luxury Goes to Gold Pearl, which adds a beautiful shine and shimmer. Next, she'll be using Just Resin's Bright Gold, followed by Just Resin's Pigment Paste in the shade Titanium White. And always be sure to mix your pigment pastes in their containers. 
She uses a torch gun to help heat up the surface of the coasters, which will also help to evaporate any moisture or humidity that could potentially get trapped in the resin. She pours her resin onto each coaster and uses a wooden stick to make sure that it's reached the edges. She's making sure that it's covered the whole area of the coasters besides the sand area. And leaving the sand area without resin will help to prevent the resin from pushing back after blowing out your waves. If you'd like a more detailed video on creating cells and lacing, I'll leave a video linked above. She starts to apply her white pigmented resin along the shoreline. And also adds in her gold pigmented resin. She uses a heat gun to blow out the waves. Then goes in with a torch gun which helps to open up some of that lacing. And does the same on the next coaster. If you guys are enjoying this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up and leave your thoughts in the comments below. Before she's done, she does add a final top coat as the last step, and here's the final product. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, subscribe to see more videos like this in the future. Follow me on my Instagram, Summer Girl Designs, and my mom's Instagram, Wild Heart Resin Art.